everybody. Welcome to another This Is What Happened, but you weren't here. So you missed the vlog. Uh, yeah, don't look at the kitchen. It's the maid's day off to work her other job. So, alright. Um, yeah, I'm making some soup and I'm making myself my new favorite drink, which happens to be a chai. So, yeah, pretty much any green tea chai or Tazo or Tezo, however you say that, organic chai cocoa chai tea anything works really good right now at the moment my favorite is the salada green tea chai so yeah I'm just going to show you how I do that I take my boiling water and fill it up in my cup and yeah it's a big cup I like it I'm a coffee drinker through and through but uh, something about the green tea it's just really it's nice it almost is like a little dessert in a cup but also well, this is kind of like ketchup vlog, so I'm going to be all over the place today. One of my favorite things to eat at night, a lot of people ask me, you know, um, about my diet. I get the Swiss Miss Diet Cocoa, 25 calories, and I put it in a cup of coffee. That's not exactly eating. <laughs> well, I mean, it makes you feel like you've had a dessert because it's chocolate and coffee, so it's like a mocha. So I usually do this. I don't even count this on my diet because it's only 25 calories. So I'll put that in instead of milk. Oh, I've got to fill up Sean's soup here, too. Sean was begging for some uh, cup of noodles. All right, so that's going to have to sit. All right, so what I usually do is I take my Truvia, which is Stevia, and Truvia is just the name brand, and while the tea bag is sitting in there, I just dump this past it so that it goes to the bottom and hangs out, because then it, it tastes more like real sugar that way. Okay, so... Uh, rough day at work today. I had a big problem. My pants are too loose. I could practically pull these pants off without like opening the button. So yeah, it was kind of embarrassing because every time I got up to get something out of the file cabinet or something, I was in danger of losing my pants. And I don't have a belt because I just don't have a belt. I was too fat before to buy a belt. So now I have to buy one, I think. All right, so Maddie... I need you to do some stuff for me when you come home for Thanksgiving break. I need you to go through Ulta. I need you to check out the new Avon catalog. I need you to check out Delia's and Alloy and Urban Outfitters. So I want you to look through all of those things and tell me Christmas ideas because it's hard. I can't think of anything now that you guys are getting so much older. What do you need? What do you want? It's hard. Um, a cat or a piano. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, right away. Alright, so, yeah. I was oh, at... Preferably a cat. Yeah. Or two. I was at uh, Rite Aid yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. And they had the Revlon buy one, get one free. So I tried the Revlon Colorstay Mineral Mousse in fair slash light. It's got SPF of 20 in here, so... I'm always interested in something with a sunscreen because my skin is very sensitive to light. And I also tried the Revlon Age Defying Spa. That's got SFP 18. And this one is in Fair Light. This one I tried this morning and I'm wearing it right now. And I must say, it's held up really well over the day. It's been about, let's see, about 10 hours now since I put my makeup on this morning. And I haven't really touched it up at all, so... I'm pretty happy with the Revlon Colorstay Mineral Mousse. I haven't tried the age-defying one yet. I'm having a feeling that it's going to be a little greasy. And I'm not so sure about the brush applicator. We'll have to get back to you on that one. Also, this week in Target, this past week, for some reason, I don't know whether it was just my Target or all the Targets, they had the Wet n Wild marked down like ridiculously. Uh, this palette is normally $4.99. I got it for $1.26, and I'm wearing uh, the eyeshadow from it today. Yeah, get ready, Maddie, because that's what I'm using to do your eye makeup. <laughs> with. This is... And for, let the record show that Maddie told me I was allowed to do one makeup look on her. All right, well, on. we'll have to put that in a blog. But those colors in there are really gorgeous, and I'm wearing uh, the one on the bottom in the crease in the middle part. And this one on the under the brow on the top here, and this coppery colored one on the lid. So yeah, I'm really loving this palette for a dollar twenty-six. Hell yes! Don't worry, I won't make you look like a tranny. 
<sighs> this one too. I was wearing this one in uh, videos last week. This one was normally $2.99, marked down to $0.76. Cents. Who could pass this up? Beautiful colors. I wore this to church. It wasn't horrorish at all. <laughs> and also the Wet n Wild Mega Eyes, the cream eyeliner. I guess this is in black. Normally $3.99, I got it for $0.96, cents, so I guess these were all 75% off. This stuff is amazing. It's just as good as Bobbi Brown cream eyeliner or gel eyeliner, whichever it is by Bobbi Brown. You get like the same amount and the quality is amazing. So like for under a dollar, throw away the brush that came with it and get a professional uh, eyeliner brush. This stuff is the bomb. Okay, so I'm going to finish up my tea here. And uh, yeah, I just like mine with a little bit of milk. So this is my new favorite drink. I'm also interested in getting another coffee maker. I don't know if anybody's had experience with the Keurig uh, coffee makers, but they look really fun. Love coffee makers. Got the personal size. Got the regular size for company. And I have an espresso machine as well. I don't know. Is a fourth coffee maker overkill? Yep. I do. I do have more in the basement too, but that one looks really interesting. And I know what the book's been saying. The pumpkin coffee is really good. So if anybody has one, let me know if you love it or not. And I guess that's probably about it today. I think we've covered all the bases. So, got to get a belt. Got to enjoy my drink. Give Sean his soup. And more makeup looks. So, kids, till next time. Much love.